you having fun yet? Last. I'm so happy to be on vacation. Aren't you, Mom? <laughs> If ever there was a vlog-worthy moment, it's being stranded with a flat tire on the side of the road in Mexico. And this is only the tail end of the adventures of this girl. I just want to go to my hotel. <laughs> Trying to get to Mexico. That was racist. Secretor de Secretaria de Turismo. What? Attention al turista! I thought that the um, mud flaps at Guadalajara jail, but it's, <laughs> <laughs> it's Guadalajara Yali or something. My, I need to charge my battery. <laughs> waiting for like a whole bunch of <laughs> to drive up in a pickup truck and steal all my luggage. <laughs> That's all I'm waiting for. Oh, oh policia! <laughs> no, it's the Aww, ambulance. It's the ambulance. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so I'll tell so you okay, Charlotte's okay. story starts when we booked our trips in September. 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 The next, <laughs> the day we booked our trip and we booked our flight, Charlotte calls me. So my friend's wedding is that day. So now she has to go to DC. So she changes it. She books her flight to DC. It's all great. Charlotte's flight was canceled to DC. Spent three hours on hold with waiting United. with United. So they were no help. So Charlotte rents a car, drives to New York City that on Friday night. That night, Friday night. And then drives to Washington, D.C. from New York City on Saturday morning. With about three hours of sleep. Goes to the wedding, makes it to the wedding, makes it to the full wedding and the reception. The Sleeps at the hotel that night. Yep, slept at the hotel. Sunday morning. At 5 a.m. At 5 a.m. She goes to the Washington, D.C. I don't know where you tell us. Dulles. Yeah. She's at Dulles. She goes to get in our flight. People are being lazy and slow and They're annoying. Her flight was a little delayed. By two hours. Sitting in the plane for well, two hours. Well, people were slow. And then... And then as soon as the cabin doors closed, it started raining. And then the rain froze. And then we couldn't take off for two hours. So she missed her flight from L.A. to Cabo San Lucas. Or By wherever. five minutes. By five minutes. There were no more flights from Los Angeles to Cabo that night. So she sends at NBC Suites last night. Yep, they're very nice. Uh, mind you, this whole thing's happening. I've been in Cabo with her parents for two days. <laughs> Just me and her parents in Cabo for two days. Those poor, poor people stuck with me for two days. Mm -hmm. So today, get a text. She's on board. Yes. She gets stuck behind an old couple at Customs. Two elderly couples at Customs. She gets stuck behind two Elderly couples at customs. We finally make it out. Oh, P.S. Her parents decided to buy a new timeshare yesterday. So we had to stop at that timeshare and have lunch there. Charlotte was I, near tears, not happy. I've been in the same clothes for four days. <laughs> for four days. Finally, she went to the clothes. car and put this dress on. Thank put God. A new, put a new outfit on. So she's cooler now, though yep. it's starting to get a little it's toasty. A little toasty <laughs> in the car. car. <laughs> also because we're a little what word in the sand you know? <laughs> What did she say? What did she say? She's not smashed. She's, what did she say? She's not plastered. What, what was the word she used? What was the word she used? Wrecked? No. No. She but, used some really great funny word <laughs> for the fact that we've had three at least two double tequila margaritas. Yup. At lunch. So fast forward, we're driving, we're finally back in the car to go to the hotel. hotel which is all I've wanted since Friday. Get to our room, relax, go to the pool, spend some time in the sun. We're driving, we're driving, we're driving. We're not driving anymore. <laughs> flat tire. Now the two of us have, have never experienced a I've flat never tire had a flat before. Tire, no. I didn't know what it felt like. Now I know what it feels like. But apparently like. no one in Mexico has ever experienced a flat tire either. <laughs> since... <laughs> we've got a bus. No. I don't know if you can see it, but we've got a full bus behind us, and he's first two very nice Mexican boys stopped. Yeah, and they were cute too. They were very but cute. But they didn't have the tool we needed. No. Um, the rental car company wants to charge $20 to come change a tire. Which Ann and Charlie are not having. <laughs> Miss Ann and Charlie want nothing to do with that. Nope. Mind you, Charlie, her father, changes, like, redoes, redoes tires. rebuilds cars. Rebuilds cars, mm -hmm. like he does. So we trust him to not, we had to get out of the car. So this stop, we've got a tow truck over there, and they're trying to change the tire. Oh, oh man. <laughs> Miss Ann, what was the word you used for how you were at the restaurant? Your state of mind and loaded. loaded. <laughs> 
Look at that tire. That was old. Look at all the tips you have to go. Whoa, look at him go. I want to do that. <laughs> this is the greatest vacation of my entire life. <laughs> look at him go. It's the greatest. Yes, that place. They match, though. Did you notice your father matches the Mexican bus driver? <laughs> that tire is torn to shreds. What did we hit? Look at that thing. It's torn apart. I'll show you this on the other camera. It's a Fiesta bus. See? Oh, yeah. Fiesta bus, and it looks like the McDonald's M's right there. I want to try to climb this because I have to pee really bad. You're really close. <laughs> if I How many bikes are I just can't. This is so great. Hi, Mom. I'm gonna film you taking a picture. This is more fun than anything I've ever done in my entire life. Some sort of charging is happening over here. Jen, come out here. Try to speak Spanish. <laughs> no. I'm sorry. Come on. What was it? Cerveza, tequila, baño. <laughs> Only three words you ever need to know in Spanish. I have to know no, as in no leche, no mantequilla, no queso. Mantequilla. Butter. Butter. Lessons we've learned today. Mexicans are very nice. <laughs> such a broad statement. In daylight, they won't steal your luggage. We know that for a fact. So it all of my stuff back in the line. It takes four Mexicans and one American to change a tire. It's not a punchline, it's just a fact we learned today. Including one who jumps on top tire. of the wrench. <laughs> and bus drivers can afford to stop for 20 minutes to help change a tire. I think that's... that's Sounds about right. Oh, and Charlotte is cursed. <laughs> yep. Travel cursed. Travel cursed. Uh, I think that's about it. I think that's about it. So, I'll see you when I get back from high school.